Carmel by the Sea was developed for artists and writers, actors and bohemians and photographers. Carmel by the Sea is its creative mecca. People conversing over a cup of coffee, thinking about, what are you doing today? What are you going to create today? You can't come to Carmel and not stop into one of the many different galleries here. I'm about to go on the Carmel Art Tour. Come along. Hello, Stephen. Your work is beautiful. Thank you. I just practice a lot. Yeah. <laughs> we just finished uh, a 11 and a half foot Jumbo the Elephant for Tufts University. Welcome, everyone. Hi. Hi. This is remarkable. Wow. Thank you. Taking a gallery tour allows someone to be able to get a feel for what you're looking for, what your style is, and it's something that you also are enjoying while you're here. You're seeing the photography, but you're also seeing the real thing out there when you tour the peninsula. Here we are, the Mary Titus Gallery. Mary is painting over here today in her gallery studio, oh. just in the tradition oh. of Old Carmel. I like to keep it fresh, and I'm in the moment when I'm painting. And if you see in the gallery, there's not one painting that looks like another one. I like teaching too, and I teach also um, couples. Rohana, note to self, the husband and I are taking a, okay. a painting okay. class okay. with Mary. <laughs> but I think also the spirit of the, of the founding people of Carmel, you know, they were artists, they were bohemians, they were people who appreciated and wrote about and took pictures of and painted the nature around here, and I think by default then you preserve it because you love it. The serenity of the little village in the forest by the sea just spurns all these wonderful ideas, and uh, that's why we're so unique here right now.